Do you want to know why vitamin A is essential for our health? Well, buckle up because I'm about to take you on a journey through the various roles that vitamin A plays in our body. First up, let's talk about our eyesight. Did you know that vitamin A is essential for maintaining good vision? It contains a particular protein called rhodopsin that helps us see in low light conditions. Without enough vitamin A, we might experience night blindness or other vision problems. Now let's move on to our immune system. Vitamin A is like a superhero that helps us fight off harmful bacteria and viruses. It allows the production of white blood cells that attack and destroy these pathogens, reducing the risk of infection. But that's not all. Vitamin A is also essential for maintaining healthy skin and mucous membranes. It helps to repair and produce skin cells, promoting healthy skin and reducing the risk of infection. And if you're worried about your growth and development, vitamin A has you covered there too. It supports the proper formation and maintenance of various organs in our body, including the heart, lungs and kidneys. It also helps regulate cellular growth and differentiation, which is critical for proper development. Now let's not forget about our reproductive health. Vitamin A plays a role in the normal formation and maintenance of the reproductive organs. It is essential for both men and women, helping to maintain healthy reproductive tissues and supporting proper fetal development during pregnancy. Finally, let's talk about vitamin A's antioxidant properties. It helps to protect our body against harmful molecules called free radicals, which can cause damage to our cells and lead to chronic diseases and premature aging. So, as you can see, vitamin A is a crucial nutrient that plays many vital roles in our body's functions. Vitamin A works best when you have some healthy fats in your diet. So, don't forget to include foods like nuts, seeds and avocados to help your body absorb all the goodness of vitamin A. You might wonder if you must take supplements to get enough vitamin A. While supplements can be beneficial in addressing deficiencies, it's crucial to consult with a healthcare professional, as excessive intake can be harmful. Vitamin C. Vitamin C is a nutrient that is essential for our bodies to function correctly. It helps keep our immune system strong, making us less likely to get sick. We'll discuss the best sources of vitamin C, how you can get enough of it, and why it's essential for your health. You can find vitamin C in fruits and vegetables like red bell peppers, kiwi, strawberries, oranges, grapefruit, guava, papaya, mango, pineapple, and spinach. Eating these foods regularly will help you get the vitamin C your body needs to stay healthy. In the description box below, we've listed the top 10 foods with vitamin C and their respective RDA, recommended dietary allowance measurements. But sometimes, eating these foods may not be enough, especially if you have certain medical conditions or dietary restrictions. That's when vitamin C supplements come in handy. Vitamin C supplements help ensure you get enough of this essential nutrient. But did you know that vitamin C also helps your body absorb iron from plant-based sources? This is especially important for people with iron deficiency anemia. However, it's important to note that high doses of vitamin C can interact with certain medications like blood thinners and some cancer treatments. So, it's always best to speak with your healthcare provider before taking any new supplements to ensure you get the right amount for your needs. Vitamin D. Vitamin D is believed to play a role in regulating mood and reducing the risk of depression, especially seasonal depression, which can occur in areas with limited winter sunlight. It has anti-inflammatory properties and is thought to play a role in maintaining neurological health. Vitamin D is essential for maintaining strong bones. It can enhance calcium absorption in the gut, which is necessary for maintaining strong and healthy bones. It also plays a vital role in the functioning of the immune system and has been linked to a reduced risk of certain infections and immune-related disorders. Now, let's talk about the top dietary sources of vitamin D. While sunlight exposure is a primary source, several dietary options can boost your vitamin D intake. Fatty fish like salmon and mackerel, cod liver oil, fortified milk, fortified orange juice, fortified cereals, eggs, cheese, beef liver, and certain mushrooms like maitake and shiitake can help boost your vitamin D intake. Vitamin D deficiency is a significant health concern, especially for individuals with limited sunlight exposure or inadequate dietary intake of this crucial vitamin. Vitamin D deficiency can weaken bones, increasing the risk of fractures. In children, a lack of vitamin D can cause rickets, a condition marked by soft and weak bones, while in adults. It can lead to osteoporosis, characterized by porous and fragile bones. Adequate vitamin D levels have been linked to a reduced risk of heart disease, 
as it may regulate blood pressure and prevent artery damage. It contributes to muscle strength as it regulates the levels of calcium ions within muscle cells. Its deficiency has been linked to an increased risk of muscle weakness and falls, particularly in older people. Therefore, maintaining adequate levels of vitamin D is essential to overall health. Vitamin E. Vitamin E is a crucial antioxidant player that shields our cells from damage. First off, let's talk about the antioxidant power of vitamin E. Vitamin E is known for its potent antioxidant properties, which protect cells from oxidative stress and free radicals. Regular consumption of vitamin E-rich foods or supplements ensures adequate protection and numerous health benefits. So, what are the rich dietary sources of vitamin E? Vitamin A is abundant in various foods, especially nuts and seeds. Here are the top 10 sources. Sunflower seeds, almonds, hazelnuts, spinach, avocado, mango, rainbow trout, olive oil, kiwi, and broccoli. Now let's talk about the benefits of vitamin E. Firstly, vitamin E offers antioxidant support. It helps protect cells from damage caused by free radicals, which can lead to cell damage and contribute to cardiovascular disease and cancer development. Secondly, vitamin E plays a significant role in skin health. It helps maintain skin integrity and appearance, protecting it from damage caused by UV rays and environmental pollutants. This property also makes it a common ingredient in skincare products for its anti-aging effects. Thirdly, vitamin E is essential for a robust immune system. It aids in the body's immune response, helping to fend off bacteria and viruses. Fourthly, consuming adequate vitamin E can help reduce the risk of age-related macular degeneration, a common cause of blindness in older adults. And lastly, vitamin E may help prevent or delay the onset of heart disease. It does this by preventing the formation of blood clots, which can lead to heart attack or stroke. Now that you know the benefits of vitamin E, let's talk about how to optimize its absorption. The intake of dietary fats heavily influences the absorption of vitamin E, as it is a fat-soluble vitamin. Studies have shown that fat in the digestive tract can significantly enhance the body's ability to absorb vitamin E. Pairing vitamin E foods with healthy fats is recommended to optimize vitamin E absorption. For example, drizzling olive oil over spinach or having avocado with sunflower seeds can be effective strategies. This combination not only enhances the absorption, but also ensures a balanced intake of nutrients. Overall, vitamin E is an essential nutrient that provides numerous benefits for your health and well-being. So, ensure you include vitamin E-rich foods in your diet and consider supplements if necessary. Vitamin K. Vitamin K, or philoquinone, is crucial for blood clotting and maintaining strong bones. But did you know it has other significant benefits too? But first, let's dive in and explore the top 10 dietary sources of vitamin K. These include kale, spinach, Swiss chard, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, green beans, cabbage, prunes, kiwi, and blueberries. Now let's talk about the benefits of vitamin K. First, vitamin K is essential in synthesizing proteins necessary for blood clotting. Without sufficient vitamin K, it can significantly impair the blood's clotting ability, potentially causing excessive bleeding from wounds or injuries. Next, vitamin K is critical in bone metabolism as it helps to modify bone proteins, which helps maintain bone strength and density. It's crucial in preventing osteoporosis and fractures in older people. Vitamin K also helps regulate calcium deposition, preventing the calcification of arteries and other soft tissues and reducing the risk of heart diseases and strokes. Furthermore, vitamin K is critical in supporting immune function, aiding in calcium regulation, wound healing, reducing cancer risk, supporting cognitive health, and having anti-inflammatory properties. Now let's talk about deficiency and the need for supplementation. While deficiency is rare, certain conditions can lead to low levels. People with fat malabsorption disorders or those who have been on long-term antibiotics may experience deficiencies. Supplementation may be necessary, especially for individuals on blood-thinning medications as vitamin K plays a critical role in blood clotting. Consuming these foods with fats is essential as vitamin K is fat-soluble, which enhances absorption. So there you have it, vitamin A's importance to vitamin K. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and share it with your loved ones. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.